Liverpool's James Milner plays up to boring tag with classic Christmas tweet. There are many things you can count on at Christmas. Mince pies on the table, turkey in the oven, presents under the tree, and a classic tweet from James Milner. The Liverpool veteran has developed an unwanted reputation as a boring character down the years, thanks largely due to a parody Twitter account set up in his name. But Milner has done well to abolish that theory in recent times with several humorous posts to show off his funny side, which has made him a popular character among his teammates and fans. And with Liverpool's Boxing Day clash versus his hometown club Leeds United postponed due to COVID-19, Milner couldn't resist the opportunity for another amusing update from his Christmas Day celebrations. What Christmas present would you buy Liverpool in January? Let us know your ideal transfer in the comments section. Sat at home and clearly getting into the festive spirit, Milner uploaded a picture onto social media of him wearing a yellow hat straight from his Christmas cracker, while accompanied by his pet husky. In front of him were four coasters and a wine glass filled with a red liquid, though it wasn't what you might think, as he was knocking back non-alcoholic juice drink slower. The self-confessed teetotal drinker wrote, Four new coasters and some anti-wrinkle eye cream, Christmases don't come much better. Happy Christmas everyone. Number Santacnus Mesowell number Hivishler session. There was also a strategically placed balloon in the background of the anti-Christmas cartoon character The Grinch. Milner is very much the opposite of his unfairly assumed image, with teammate Andy Robertson previously claiming the midfielder has the funniest banter in the Liverpool squad. In the past, the 35-year-old has posted images of him ironing his clothes or during lockdown shared videos of him cutting his lawn with a pair of scissors. He has also aimed a tongue-in-cheek dig at Trent Alexander-Arnold this season, after the fullback was absent for the match with Crystal Palace, forcing Milner into the roll-up against tricky winger Wilfried Zaha. Trent's definitely going to get some ribbing for that, Milner told the club website. A bit of Zaha-itis or something like that. Milner also credited Divock Origi's expertly back goal against Preston recently to the striker's yoga paying off. Despite his advancing years, Milner remains a key figure in Jurgen Klopp's plans, being called upon recently amidst a number of injury problems and COVID absences. Liverpool may well be relieved that their clash with Leeds has been called off, giving them a few extra days to prepare for the trip to Leicester on December 28. Klopp used Christmas Day to send a special message to the club's fans, in which he reserved praise for the NHS and frontline workers, while also insisted he and the Liverpool players never have, and never will, take having a full Anfield for granted. He added, from the bottom of my heart, and all of my players and staff, thank you for your commitment, sacrifice, support, love and patience over the last 12 months.